John Paolino. Good morning, Your Honor. Good morning, sir. Mr. Paolino, you, you're charged with obstructing a driveway. Yeah, it's on Clifford Street. There, there were cars parked all up and down the street. Did you take a photograph? No, I didn't. <clears throat> oh, so, so you, you want me just to depend on your word? Well. No, you, you're saying to yourself, I'm going to go to court, present myself as an honorable, honest, citizen who would never violate the law. Is that right? That's right. And you're going to say, you know, Judge, I never had a parking ticket in Providence. Mm, no. Nope. How do I know that? My record? Because I have your record before me. Right. Now, I'm very curious about this Inspector Quinn because he lives on Whipple Avenue in Barrington. Correct. Now, a long time ago, we lived in Providence. I was born and raised on Federal Hill in Providence. Yeah. And we used to make a pilgrimage to Barrington to visit my father's cousins okay and they lived on 90 Whipple Avenue oh, yeah. right. and their name was Corrado yeah right Betty Boop right and he's the, a mailman my uncle's my father's uncle's name they used to call him Zebep Zebep now <laughs> many people abbreviate names they use a dialect his yeah. real name was Zio right Pepino, right? Or Zio Giuseppe. Giuseppe, they call him Pepino. Yeah. So it, was, it should have been Zio Pepino, but I didn't know. They called him Zebep. So I thought that was his name. I said, what kind of a name is Zebep, right? <laughs> We're going to go see Zebep. And they had these, uh, in the backyard, they had a big, long concrete table. It had to be 20 foot long. Yeah. And they had grapevines. Grapevines, yeah. Right? And they used to cook the best food. We'd get there Sunday about 1 o'clock in the afternoon, and we eat until 9 o'clock at night, right? Yeah. And Zebep made sure that he drank at least two gallons of wine before we left. Yeah. <laughs> so you knew the Corrados, huh? Yeah. I went to school with uh, one of the sons, Michael. Yeah. It was Michael and Tony. Yeah. Anyway. Haven't seen them in a long time. They were wonderful people. I don't think they're there anymore. Yeah. I think they all moved out. It was uh, Zia Filomena and Zio Pepino, right? Filomena and Pepep. Zebep. Do you have anybody named Zebep in your family, Inspector Quinn? No. <clears throat> you know, I, a lot of Patrick's. I, I'm talking way back a long time ago, but those were yeah, some, those were such precious days because on Sundays, all the family got together, whether yeah. we visited them or they came to see us. Yeah. And you know, they never forgot any event. They always were there. You remember the house? Yeah. Oh yeah. With the grapevine and all that. There's two stories. Yes, that's right. There was yeah. a little store in the front. Yeah. Yeah. To the left of the house. Well. I know all the rich people lived on that street, so you're going to pay triple fine. Yeah, well. It's the only ticket you've had in Providence. It's the first one. It's a parking ticket. We're going to give you a break on it. The matter is dismissed. Good I appreciate that, Your Honor. Good luck to you. Thank you.